Hello, here is one more quick tip on um, how to make sure you are collecting student email addresses with every Google Form you've created. Um, if you're familiar with Google Forms, you've might, you might have had this happen to you before. Um, if you don't specifically say in the settings to collect student email addresses when you create the form, then um, you might not be able to tell who submitted what. And if you don't ask or create a question that asks them to list their name, that could also be a problem. Um, it's really hard to figure out how to how to find that if you didn't ask for it in the, to begin with. Um, so, but in the future, if you make that mistake in the future, um, what you can do to make sure you don't make it again is go to the three dots on your Google form and then click on preferences. And then these are default settings for your Google form. So these are the ones that I just keep on all the time because I most likely want them to be that way. And if I like don't want the questions to be required, I'll just turn that off when I'm making it. Um, so collect email addresses, it's a default setting for me. Um, make questions required as a default setting and then default quiz point values. So I just keep all of those checked so that I never run into that mistake of forgetting to collect student email addresses on forms. Um, so then you say save and now if you were to create a new Google form, so I'll go into my drive and say new form and then if I click on that little settings wheel um, it automatically has that checked so um, in case you didn't know that that was a preference that you could uh, set on your Google Forms now you do and hopefully you find that helpful thanks